In this video today, we're gonna to be taking a look at how profitable coffee is when you're running precision farming. Welcome back everybody, Driver53 here with another precision farming video and today we're gonna to be taking a look at coffee. That's right, coffee. And how profitable this crop is whenever you're running precision farming. So this is gonna be a kind of follow-up video to the one that we put out yesterday um, about mustard because we're on Riverbird once again and these are the two new crops, mustard and coffee. So I wanted to jump on here and based on the video that I did my map tour, the update, um, I think this is gonna be an incredible, incredible crop to grow. Um, the price is outrageous on this. The yield is insane. I think it's gonna be absolutely phenomenal. So let's go ahead and take a look and see how I set it up. So as you can see, I limed everything, I've got it plowed, so we're good to go there. We're gonna get the max yield from that. If we take a look at the map, you can see I've got my four soil types right here, same as the last video. And if you come across over here, you can see that I've got everything planted out. Now, each one of these areas is going to be uh, a half an acre, almost exactly. Because if you come over here, you can see that on my sown hectares, I've got 2.00. So once again, that's how we did this. So if we come back over here, soil types, you can see my pH right where it needs to be. Nitrogen right where it needs to be. So we're absolutely perfect on this. Now, the really interesting thing, nothing's at 200. Then we jump down to 180. That's going to be our loam. And then 160 is going to be our sandy loam. 140 is going to be our silty clay. And then 120 is loamy sand. So really, really cool that it's higher, but not super high. So it's gonna save you a little bit of money on your uh, nitrogen right off the bat. So what we need to do now is just go ahead and harvest all this, and then we'll come back and I'll show you guys all the data. And once again, you're gonna use just a regular header right here. So let's go ahead and hop in here and uh, get started. All right, everybody, we got done finally with all four soil types. And y'all, we got a lot of yield here, like I expected. Um, on loam, we had to use the trailer to even finish off this one section right here. So absolutely phenomenal, phenomenal. So um, let's go ahead and jump into the spreadsheet here. And you guys are gonna be so shocked. It is awesome. All right, here we go. So once again, what we're doing is we are comparing to wheat. Like I said, I want to compare to wheat because that is going to be like, like I said, giants like go-to crop, right? And we used it for the mustard also. So I figure why not compare it here too? But as you can see y'all, um, seed usage, it's a little bit more. It kind of makes sense. And then fertilizer, it's, you know, not quite as much as the wheat is which is kind of surprising to me, but you're not going as far into the nitrogen requirements, right? You're not going up as far as what wheat is. So you're good there. Harvest yield though, y'all, that is insane. Absolutely insane. Um, 21,234 for loamy sand, all the way up to 32,612 for loam. Now we only did a half acre here, right? That's why I just only had to unload once. So all of these figures that you're seeing on this sheet are for one full acre, 32,612 liters, roughly, right? Within, I'd say within 500 liters. So that's phenomenal. Now the price, average crop price, I will say I was checking as this was growing and that was the lowest price that I'd seen the coffee sell for, was for fourteen seventy eight. Now you may ask how many days that I went. We've heard that this crop takes a while to grow. Well, this crop took about seventy six hours to grow, three full days, and then four hours, like four and a half. So a little bit over seventy six hours to grow in game time, and that's on fast. That's on fast growth. I can't believe it, but you can see the very last column, what we're going to be making on this 30, almost $31,000 profit on loamy sand 
all the way up to almost $48,000 profit per acre on loam. That is absolutely insane. $48,000. I can't believe it. This is the money crop. Coffee. I know it takes a long time, but think about this. Wheat takes about 21 hours to grow. This takes less than 80, right? So about three and a half goes of wheat versus one of this. So basically four times of wheat, okay? If, because you have to consider you're going to have to replant and everything like that. So honestly, you're only going to get about, I mean, yeah, let's just say four anyway. Because you could probably turn a field around in about an hour if you had a bunch. So, if you multiply 8271 times four, that's still only $32,000. But you have all those other fees. You have the tractor and everything like that, the worker fees, everything like that. You know, three additional times. Or, you do coffee once, and you get almost 48000 I know which one I'm doing. I know which one I'm doing. That is absolutely insane on that price. That's going to be it for today, everybody. If you enjoyed the video, go ahead and give me a thumbs up if you would. If you want to be kept up to date on all my latest precision farming videos, think about hitting that subscribe button. And if you do, hit the notification bell too. Have a great day, everybody. Until next time, this is Driver53, signing off.